We're now going to talk a little bit about water, and that's certainly an issue important with greenhouse sustainability. Uh, especially in the Netherlands, there are a lot of crops that are produced in a hydroponic system. And over time, there are different nutrients that will accumulate. And so if I understand correctly, this experiment is focused on uh, accumulation of sodium and how to expel that. Is that correct? Yeah, that's correct. Because uh, this is sweet pepper and, uh, well, the, the water growers, they recirculate the water and then uh, they constantly add nutrients to it. But then also the, uh, the level of sodium is, uh, is getting higher, okay. it accumulates. And at a certain level, growers should get rid of that, uh, that water. But they, then they also lose a lot of uh, other nutrients like nitrogen. So what we're doing here is to find the best strategy of um, giving water, uh, applying uh, ni uh, nitrogen, uh, applying other nutrients um, in combination with the, the production. And for example, Mike was doing the experiments. He's a student from Poland. Maybe you can show us a little bit of the setup the of the, these experiments, mm -hmm. the, the, the root systems. There is okay. a, some spraying techniques over there. Um, so treatments are not only water and nutrient treatments, uh, different levels of, of nutrient solutions, but also what Michael's doing now is uh, making uh, different uh, treatments on a fruit load. Okay. So the ultimate goal is to recharge your water without expelling, with expelling as little nutrition as yep. possible, yep, yep. and also doing that in a way that doesn't hamper the quality of the fruit. Yep, that's that correct. Right? Very good. Thank you very much. Thank you.